I think the best female character for the Queen of Westeros would probably be, I think it would be Maisie. I think it would be Arya. Sansa would make the best Queen of Westeros because I love Sophie to pieces. <laughs> Arya, just because Maisie's my princess. Because she's, oh, she's been fighting for it since the beginning. She's always secretly wanted to be there, I think. And she's probably the only sane one out of all of us. Um, all myself. Probably me, but, uh, you know, I think she might murder most of the population. Um, I'd like to see Brienne, she'd make an interesting ruler. I think she'd be very fair. I can't just choose one queen. I think it has to be two queens. And I think it has to be Sansa Stark and Arya Stark together on that throne. And of course, um, I've always slightly championed Arya. Sansa's strength and the, and the strategy she's developing intellectually and Arya's insight and physical strength and abilities. And that's what I'd like to see. Because she's seriously badass and has a huge amount of passion and she's so skilled with the sword. My God, none of us have got training, but she has. So, well, Marjorie would do a pretty stonking good job, but it's probably Danny's destiny more than any of the three of us, I think. Vote Danny now. Vote Danny the Queen. <laughs> um, who would make the worst Queen? Oh, oh, that's really hard. It's like it's like bitching about someone behind their back. <laughs> that's probably obvious. There is no way Marjorie could condone such a thing. Cersei because she's been there before and she did a terrible job. <laughs> she's, she's crazy, so yeah, maybe not Cersei, she's not so great. I'd also quite like to see Cersei on the Iron Throne and watch everything turn to dust. <laughs>